Sunday evening's episode of the History Channel's hit series The Bible, threw up an awkward coincidence when viewers noticed that Satan bore a remarkable resemblance to President Obama. Twitter exploded into life during the airing of the latest edition of the Mark Burnett produced series, with most noting the striking similarities between the president and the devil played by actor Mehdi Uzani. Wall Street's stock rally is facing pressure from another flare-up of Europe's debt crisis. Cyprus announcement over the weekend that Eurozone finance leaders were pressing for a one-time tax on depositors' savings in exchange for a financial bailout shocked global investors. The proposal to have Cyprus savers share the financial burden of a bailout adds new elements of uncertainty and unpredictability to Europe's debt crisis. Worried depositors rushed to withdraw cash in Cyprus, where banks are closed for a holiday Monday. Villagers in Turkey's Kokeli province were left baffled after a nearby bridge totally disappeared. The 25-meter, 22-ton bridge provided a safe crossing over a creek that separated local homes from orchards on the other side, yet on Monday puzzled residents discovered that the entire thing had vanished into thin air. Authorities soon determined that the bridge had been cut into pieces and loaded onto the back of a truck by thieves who hoped to sell it as scrap metal. The Russian Navy will maintain five to six warships in the Mediterranean Sea as a task force to defend Russia's interests in the area, Navy Commander Admiral Viktor Cherkov said on Sunday. Up to five or six warships must be present in the Mediterranean Sea on a permanent basis and control must be exercised through the command of the Russian Black Sea Fleet. I have this story uploaded on my channel if you wish to learn more. A family of chemicals naturally produced by fungi are phenomenally effective at killing human cancer cells, according to a study conducted by researchers from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign, and published in the journal Chemical Science. I have this story uploaded on my channel if you wish to learn more. Getting herself ready for a 2016 presidential run, Hillary Clinton has now decided to endorse same-sex marriage. I believe America is at its best when we champion the freedom and dignity of every human being, Mrs. Clinton said in a video posted Monday on the Internet by the Human Rights Campaign, a gay rights advocacy group. Finally the well-respected Pew Research Group has finished up their state of the news findings. In no shocking twist, it was found that MSNBC is the least reliable news source on television by only reporting the real news 15% of the time. The rest was just left-wing opinions from nutjob liberals. Fox News scored a 45% high 